Good morning. This is Mission Control Houston on Friday, April 19th, 2019. We're getting a live view of Northrop Grumman's Cygnus cargo vehicle just a few inches away from the International Space Station carrying 7,600 pounds of cargo. This morning, we're bringing you live coverage of the birthing of Cygnus to the Unity module on the space station. Cygnus is now currently in its berthing position and is ready for first and second stage capture to begin soon. The Canada Arm 2 has now stopped as Cygnus is in position with the common berthing mechanism. The series of locks and latches is getting ready to begin. and Cygnus is being pushed into that common birthing mechanism right now. We just received the green light for first stage berthing, now just waiting for confirmation to initiate that. The first stage will be a series of four latches, and those are will be in progress soon, securing Cygnus to the International Space Station. And first stage berthing is complete. Those four latches are complete, and now we will move to second stage berthing, where those 16 bolts will be driven. Four latches are complete. Now those 16 bolts are driving. Hey, just wanted to let you all know you guys are go for exercise. And we've completed A bolts. Happy, thank you, and well done to the uh, robo teams for making fast work of that. Yeah, copy and concur. And second stage berthing is complete. That was Capcom Neil Nagata confirming that all 16 bolts are now tightened and secured with the Cygnus spacecraft. Cygnus now fully attached to the International Space Station at 6.31 Central Time, while the space station was flying over the Indian Ocean just south of Singapore at 255 statute miles above the Earth. Cygnus will stay attached to the International Space Station for about three months and will then depart for an extended mission before it disposes of several tons of trash from the station during a fiery re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere.